My name is Rita Pereira. I'm a singer, songwriter and saxophonist. This is my family, Dom, my other half, and our three beautiful daughters. I was 17 when I started gigging in my first band, and I've been in many different acts, performing both covers and original music. I started out as a dancer and actress in musical theatre, which led to acting in independent films and small TV parts. I also had my own radio show on Vision FM. There are so many highlights in my career. Here are a few that stand out. We supported ASWAD on their UK tour. We also performed at De Montford Hall at the World Cup 98 concert. We also performed at the old Wembley Arena stage before they knocked it down. And we also performed all over Europe with a band called The Dub Factory and were featured on MTV. My voice was also featured in the outro track of the Commonwealth Games Ceremony in 2000. One of my favourite times was when we toured around the barracks in Germany performing for the soldiers. Mark Morrison invited me to sing at a record launch company at the WKD Club in Camden Town. And as a session vocalist, I've worked with many, many producers. One of my dreams came true, which was I walked into a nightclub with my friends and my song was actually being played and the dance floor was packed. This was a collaboration with two sound producers on a head candy night. One of my favourite moments was when I represented the East and West Midlands in ID 2008. I reached the semi-finals. After gigging and performing for 30 plus years, lockdown happened and everything stopped overnight. I now work for Curry's PC World. I feel so blessed that I found another job which I really love. The company, management and colleagues are so friendly and supportive. I feel like I'm part of a family there. They also support and encourage me to sing, which is really lovely. I did an online gig for them on Valentine's Day and it lifted everyone's spirits. I have nothing but gratitude for music, as it not only brings joy to me, but to others too. I touch their hearts as they touch mine. I really do believe this is what I was meant to do. I did not choose music, music chose me.